Before this upload begins, don't forget our Raptor giveaway is alive right now. You can win this epic 2017 Raptor, 20,000 miles on it, no expense was spared in building this truck. It's amazing, you will love it. You can win this truck every five bucks spent on InShaneDesigns.com gets you 10 entries to win now through the weekend. This is the biggest entry multiplier. We will be doing 10 times entry. So if you're looking to get entered to win our 2017 Raptor, get entered right now and take advantage of those 10 times entries. InShaneDesigns.com, good luck guys, don't miss out. Oh no, oh no, oh no, Rich. No! Hey, it's just another day here in paradise. <laughs> oh no, no, <laughs> no! Can never take delivery of a new car without it snowing, raining, hail, sun explodes, whatever. We'll make the best of it. We can definitely have some fun with the Raptors and uh, maybe another vehicle in the snow here. It will be really cool. But before we get into the upload and you guys get to join me on my delivery of the new car on the channel, I do have some really, really important updates for you. Number one, the toy drive was a massive, massive success. Thank you guys so much for coming out. Thank you for donating. You guys are unbelievably generous. The, the drive gets bigger every year. This was only our third one and we will make it bigger. We will make it even bigger next year. If you couldn't make it out, which I get, a lot of people didn't come out because of everything going on. Totally understandable. But if you didn't make it out this year, make sure you come out next year. It's really freaking cool. I had a great time meeting everyone. And I didn't really film it, but thanks to, uh, I wanna say 30703 crew, uh, check him out if you can, because he got some great, great footage. The footage you're looking at right now, check him out, please, and send him a thank you from, from our subscriber base, uh, because he got some great footage that I can use, and you can see the event was freaking awesome. And I usually don't film unless it's like a, a multi-day event, like Corvette to Carlisle, because then I can I can film a little bit, I can interact with people, then I can film a little bit, and I can walk around, but if I'm at an event where I only have like a couple of hours to talk to people, I like to focus on the people. And, you know, filming is like difficult, I'm trying to film, I'm trying to talk, it's just, it's easier if I don't film and I can really interact with you guys because I don't usually get to do that, especially lately. I haven't been to any event. You know, we had to do this one. We had to do this one. I actually had to take it over to make sure it still happened. The last thing I wanted to do was leave families in need and kids in need behind this season because of, you know, on top of everything else already happening to them. So we had to keep it going. And, uh, you know, I like interacting with people. <laughs> It's something I don't get to do usually, and it's a lot easier to do that if I'm not filming and I can focus on you guys. I've thought about having someone film for me, but it just, I, I just can't do it. Like, it's something about someone filming me, it just doesn't feel right. Like, I'm a guy with a GoPro, simple guy. If somebody is like filming me, it's like I'm taking it too seriously and it just, it's not my style. Check it out, we are in right to Philadelphia right. today. To and uh, we are actually going to a an animal hospital, the Ryan Animal Hospital at UPenn for Savannah back there uh, because she needs surgery on a tooth. But in I figured I'd bring you guys right along because I don't often go to Philadelphia and it's pretty freaking cool to see the big city. Harrisburg, little city. Philadelphia, big city. Very big, the biggest one in PA. Whoa! <laughs> that guy, the guy in this little, what is it, a Hyundai? He's flying, by the way. There's crap everywhere. Look at the back. I don't know if you can see the back window. I think that's like a, a multi-pack of mayonnaise in his back window. But he's flying, and uh, he just slammed on the brakes and made a big skid mark and smoked. It was kind of wild. Yeah, driving in the city is wild. I'm glad I have a big truck and I can just kind of like relax. If you run into me, it's not really my problem. That's what I've been dealing with for the past couple of days. Uh, Savannah will be okay, I assume, through this. She does have an infected tooth, which has spread to her eye already, which is the, the big danger with that kind of thing. And bulldogs might be more susceptible than other breeds to this, but an infection in one part of the head area can lead to other parts and then you, you have an out of control problem. So it's best to get it done right away. And, and this, if you are in the PA area or in the Northeast, uh, UPenn is like the best animal hospital in the world. It, it might be the best in the world and it's definitely the best one around. All right, well, I made it back from Philadelphia and uh, the car is here. I'm sorry, it's like pitch black outside, but um, 
finally, <laughs> finally. Oh my God, I can't believe it. I can't believe you guys can't see me at all. That's okay, that's okay. I thought I was gonna miss it, I really did. But they wait, the, the drivers were nice enough to wait for me about 20 minutes and uh, I am here. The venti is about to come off the trailer. This is absolutely insane. This is absolutely insane. I don't even know what to say, but Rich has like a giant light out, I guess, to film, which is crazy. Look at Rich, Rich. Your that's light. all right, I got I my GoPro with me. Guy. Rich, that's amazing. This is amazing. I gotta give you the story on this. This was my grandfather's and he used to use it with eight millimeters. I am literally blind right now and staring I, at this. I forgot totally that I even had it. I just saw it the other day. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for waiting. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Long day for me. I'm sure for you guys as well. But yeah, uh here's the unveiling. Here oh, oh my god. There it is. Drum roll. Woo! Wow. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh my God. You got a yellow truck in there too. Yep. yep. Sweet. Oh my God. Can I get in here and look at, oh yeah. my God. From Calabasas, the venti is here. Calabasas to Pennsylvania. Oh my God. Holy crap. Holy crap. Well, it's not exactly narrow, is it? Sure, all the Yeah, way, the speed I, limit. I, I know you wouldn't break the law. Those things are limited to 98. <laughs> Peg the whole time. The entire time, 98. The entire time home. <laughs> oh my God. It's gonna match so well, yeah. Oh my God. Listen. Here we go. Here we go, baby. <laughs> <laughs> B12. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. That is beautiful. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. That is gorgeous. Is that something else or what? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh my God. Wait till you guys see the inside, everything. It's, it's mint condition. Oh, yeah, it's close. It's mint in there. It is mint. It's all carbon fiber too. Oh, we got. To, I got time to talk about that. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh right. my God, I can't get too worked up. I am. I am. I should have put my jacket on. You should. It's like and, literally 20 degrees and, right and now. You should have to turn the camera around and look at your face because you are like ear to ear, smiling, can't believe it. I mean, here. it's an Aventador. It's so crazy. Like the guy, like Guard or Huracan, really cool. And and quite frankly, a better car than this to drive every day. But the, the something special about. The Aventador, the big V12. Babe, I kinda I kinda can't believe it. This is crazy. This is so crazy. It's insane. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I, I just can't believe how it looks in person. Oh my god, he's so beautiful. In park? In park? Oh, oh, gorgeous. Hey. Windows, the lights, the sharp edges. Not even real. So, not really a park. It's pretty much that, but. Yup, yup, yup. Best part. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh, the best Rats, part. Man. Oh my god. That's, That's it right there. Beautiful. This is all you need in life. Oh yeah. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, that's half, God, the, half the reason for the Aventador is the doors. Because you only get it on the V12 Lambos. I mean, that's literally half the reason. Look at, look at the plate. Look at the plate. The carbon plate? The, yeah. Well, oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. It just says Aventador right there on the edge. <laughs> oh, it's amazing. Oh, so man. Sad. Oh, my God. All right, Lolo. Well, we're blocking the road, but. Nobody cares. Our neighbor, they're used Nobody to it cares. by now, aren't they? The HOA is going to holler they're again. Used to again. It by now. You're going to hear it again from the HOA. Oh, they, they, they oh. go in by. Uh... Oh. Oh. All right, it's his first time driving it. There it is, yeah. This is happening. <laughs> Here, get, oh, get thank you. The key? Holy crap. Oh, my God. <laughs> and that's it. Uh, here's Corsa. Should have valves. Oh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> oh, man. 
Wait till Fab Speed gets done with it. Oh, I can't wait for Fab Speed. There goes the neighbor. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Say, what are these crazy That's people doing so... now? This is going to be your first little ride there, bud. Yeah, it's going to be a long ride, about 20 yards over that way. <laughs> Get it in our driveway. It is wide. Oh my god, yeah. How wide is it? It's wide. Wow, holy crap. <laughs> I would not want to pull that in. It might not even clear. No, you're good. No, you're straight. Yeah. Oh my god. It's in the garage! Let's hear it! God, baby, this oh is it. Oh my God, babe, this is congrats. It. They've never seen a whole full video with my sunglasses off. You know, it's- Oh my God, yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> wow. Oh it's gonna be every God. comment. That's why the delivery portion of the video is like out of nowhere. I'm flying up the road. I'm in a big rush because I thought I was going to miss it. The appointment took way longer than I thought it was going to take. And uh, like I even slept in the back of the Duramax for like three hours up there. It took forever. And it came to the point where I realized like, okay, the delivery truck is gonna get here about 5.30. I'm not gonna make it. And you know, it's okay. Like Gina was here, Rich was here to, to take delivery and you know, see it. But I really wanted to see this one come off the trailer. Like this was a, a special one. Really like, this is a sick moment for me. Like this is insane. And I really, really wanted to actually see it come off the trailer. And uh, you know, I was absolutely flying. I had that thing, they are limited at 98 miles per hour. And I had that thing at 98, cruise control 98 for like a solid 20 miles. And she did great by the way. That truck is amazing even at that speed. But I made it. Long story short, I made it. Without further ado, here is the Aventador on the channel, a freaking Aventador. Now, before anyone wants to comment, this is not a giveaway, not a giveaway. Just like the 63, not one. If, it is, if there is a car going to be one, I will say like, oh, it could be. You know, if it is going to be a giveaway, I'll say like, oh, you know, it might be someday or yes, it is and we'll launch it, whatever. This is not going to be ever way too expensive. I would be an idiot to give away a car. I mean, some companies can and that's great, but I would not make a profit on a $300,000 car. And that one is just not giveaway material and something that I have always wanted. So the, these two are part of my personal growing collection. And that's it right there. That's it. Well. I can die happy. This car is an incredible, incredible machine. The Aventador has always been the ultimate, ultimate dream car. And I know like I've had a 720, which was faster, but nothing can compare, like nothing compares to any Lambo. They're so unique, but nothing can compare to the V12 Lambo. And I've wanted one like forever, but I believed uh, misinformation, or maybe not misinformation, but maybe I, I feel like people were exaggerating. I believed it just like with the Gallardo. And what was cool about this whole saga on the channel, the Gallardo led me to this. Now everyone says, oh, the Aventador is a bad car. It's not, you can't drive it every day, a bad car. Well, people said the same thing about the Gallardo and I took a chance on that car and I loved it. So the Gallardo led me to this because I loved that car so much and I didn't think it drove bad at all. I was like, well, the Aventador can't be worse, right? so I might as well get it. Turns out this Aventador, and I'm not sure if it's, you know, maybe because it's a 2014 or whatever, this car drives way, way better than a 2012 Aventador I drove and even way better, like nicer than that SV I drove. I drove that car and I was like, oh my God, I can't do this every day. But this is so freaking nice. It just, it really drives good. Christmas song. Okay. <laughs> I'm dreaming of a white Christmas just like the ones I used to know. See Lambos in the snow. Yeah, where, where's it at? I know, you're used to seeing the cars <laughs> out here. You usually are out here. Oh man, I should. Donuts in the driveway I should get it out. Snow. I should get it out. It, it's up to you, my friend. <laughs> but it's so clean. I know. I just got it. I know, it. I don't blame you at all. Oh, I don't blame you at all. That's a tough, for the content I should. <laughs> but, but I don't know But the car lover in you I is know. saying, 
<laughs> leave it in here. Yeah, leave it inside. Oh. It's, a, it's a it's a fair weather car. Like I feel bad for it. It, it lived its whole life in California, and then I want I bring it here and take it in and this, this is what day it gets. one. This yeah, is what it gets. that's that's abuse. <laughs> that is abuse. <laughs> Blow that snow right off. <laughs> That's your idea of a snowblower? Yeah, nice and clean. <laughs> Basic info on the car, guys. 2014, two owner, 10K miles. Which to me, for this, is kind of right in the sweet spot, which I've gotten, I've gotten cars that are really low mileage before, and they have worked out. But I think for this, they say it's really important to drive it. And I feel like 10K for 2014 is like the perfect amount. 2014 to 2020 just drove it enough every year to keep it running and to keep it good, but never really drove it and like beat on it. Like it hasn't been driven all over the place. So it's like the perfect amount of mileage. And we'll open up the door, literally open up the door. And uh, you can see it's my spec in here, black, yellow stitching and full carbon fiber everywhere, which I had to have. And those were, that's kind of really the only thing I had to have was yellow, uh, accent stitching and then carbon fiber, which it's beautiful. And I love that all digital dash. It still looks brand new and you can see the carbon. And uh, then what's kind of neat over here is you close the door and you have a 50th anniversario badge right there in forged carbon. Very, very cool. Uh, yellow calipers and that's really about it. It doesn't have, I mean, it's kind of like your basic Aventador, but I got it for a great price, great deal. See the LP 700-4 badge down there. And the car is expelled, I think. You can see there, definitely expelled here on the side. So that's pretty cool. Uh, I don't think the doors have it, but I know the front hood, the hood and the bumper has it. So we'll do the full car, but it's about like half done already. <laughs> All right, so sport mode, in sport mode, door down, here we go. Oh, I can't believe I'm doing it, but it'll be fun, it'll be fun. It's what a car is for. giveaway is live 10 times entries going on right now if you enjoyed this upload and you're excited for the Aventador give it a big old thumbs up take care have a great night we'll see you in the next one